and welcome to our channel. It's Evangelic God in 717 and I am here for our final premiere for the Home Channel Daily Message off of the um, short that I do for both of all of you guys on both platforms. Make sure you check them out when you leave here if you have not already. Thank you so much. Please like, share, and subscribe as well to our both platforms, guys. Get us expanded. Everybody needs the message here. We have to share and share life. We're going to talk about everything at the end. This reading will take us over to Patreon, which is our extended reading, okay? But I'll go over everything at the end of the reading. If you guys are new, welcome, welcome, welcome. Odie but goodies, thank you for your love and your loyalty. We'll talk about everything at, after this, um, and then we'll take it over to Patreon. Let's hit it, y'all. So we have the overall energy is turning your back. You guys turned your back, okay? You guys were fed up with some a situation here. You have officially turned your back on the situation. We have communication telepathic communication and secrets so if there was some um clarity that you needed about a situation and you guys are um telepathically connected to your person which is mostly like twin flames or divine partnerships okay especially if you're water signs um because of the emotion um you guys have a very close tight connect connection when it comes to te telepathy with this person if they were hiding secrets from you Lord God, open those secrets up through either through dreams or communication that they gave you through tele telepathy, okay? So if you have not received it, it's coming in, okay? But you guys have turned your back. If you turned your back, more than likely you know already, okay? What you need to know. We got fed up and shady, okay? This person was, you guys are fed up with the shady situation. It was a lot of drama and chaos connected to this situation here, okay? It was very draining, all right? Love versus hate. When it comes to twin flame connection, which means a push and pull, light and dark, okay? So you guys were loving and your person was hating, okay? Yeah, if you're twins, is is um, when you guys are going through your mirror stuff and your trauma and you're triggering and all that stuff, you're, it's always one that heals and the other one does it in love and the other one treats the other one like they hate them, okay? And most, more than like most of the time, it's divine masculine, but take it however it res resonates. Okay, I'm saying that because the Empress is, is the goddess of love. So you guys, your your lesson with the, with the Empress is to learn um, your worth. Okay, this situation did trigger you to do so. If it has not, it's about to. Okay, if you guys are twin flame or divine counterparts. Take it how it resonates. You guys moved on, letting go, loving you, and you're ready for a fresh start in life. Okay. So you guys are ready to move forward. You're ready for something good in your life, something happy. Um, we don't have to deal with drama and chaos here, okay? This is going to trigger somebody to run after you. And we're not talking about like running and running after somebody. We're talking about runner chaser, divine counterparts, twin flame connections. There's always a runner chaser, um, what's that word? Paradigm, okay? Um, yeah, so if you guys were ran from this person, this person ran from you. It, it happens so that you guys can trigger in a twin flame connection, okay? This person, you turning your back and taking your power back and showing this person that you are not, a, a, you're not going to chase after them and beg for their love and act like the karmics that they were dealing with. The reason why this happens when it's a person in a relationship and our connections, a twin flame connection, is that it starts off as the, uh, most of the time, the empress in reverse is chasing the masculine. Because the empress in reverse is, tra is chasing her trauma and karma. She wants to be loved, she wants to be nurtured, but she gives too much and don't get anything back. The masculine in return is the dark side of the heart. That person has a lot of trauma and car trauma and um, issues too when it comes to their triggering. But then they're so blocked off that they are more logic. So they shut you out. They do things that are unnecessary to the connection that causes a lot of pain. Okay? This person here was very shady. They wore a mask. They were very much in love with you. But they treated you like they hated you because they were afraid of love because of the trauma and triggering that they had. They chose other people over you, let other people come in between the connection. This person also, um, they were used to being sweat, sweated by people. People sweat them all the time. Yeah. You guys dealt with this person trying to make you a third party. They tried to put you in the middle of multiple options and treat you as an option. This person took you through a lot of hell. A lot of the pain that this person took you through, they did not take other people through it. You guys went through the blunt of this of the pain because you're this person's twin flame. 
Mm -hmm. But whatever you putting your foot down now, learning your word, they they are. Um, this is something like I told you. So it's done like the um, Beauty and the Beast paradigm here. That's what it looks like to me. You have to teach this person how to treat you. You have to teach this person that you are not like the rest, and you are not a peasant. You are the empress. That's what I'm seeing here. And this person. Um, it's like a divine masculine. This masculine, the games that they play with blocking you, play, blocking your text, your calls, and things like that. This person is now wondering where you are. A lot of them don't know where you live. A lot of them are trying to find out how to get in touch with you or where you are. And they can't. Because a lot of you guys have blocked them out. If you have not blocked them out, you're walking away. You have walked away and, act, and it's made it like they're irrelevant. You let, you let the life that they had, that they wanted so badly have them. That's what it, what happened here. Yeah, this this masculine was chased was was used to being chased, used to being um, sweated by people, and and they don't understand that the people that they were chasing them was just karma. Yeah, their own trauma was chasing them, and they were running from you. They had a box on their head they couldn't even see. Yeah, that you were the blessing, and now the things that you guys have got whatever closure that you were waiting on, it came through your dreams or telepathic communication, and you guys walked away. Yeah, so you mirrored this person. Yeah, you did. You, you mirrored this person. What is shady? What did I say? A shady, your shady twin. This person was shady. This is a twin flame connection. Your twin, they, they triggered all this by their behavior. Yeah, so this person never thought you, this person knew that you guys were twins. They knew it. They were masked. They wanted to make their twin an option. This was the first mistake they made. Because if you guys, did you have the runner chaser paradigm? Like I told you, with, I'm a twin flame too. So we have the runner chaser paradigm. I ran for my connection because that's normal. I was triggered. I was scared. I was afraid. And God says when in the time, and instead, instead of, and then I had, I had a history with my mask because we were friends first and we went to school together. We grew up together. So when it, when it came to the paradigm of this connection with us, I was afraid because I was, the person that he was with was my rival and I did not trust. I did not want to be a part of that connection. You see what I'm saying? So I ran away from it because I can feel energies of when karmic energies are around him. I, at, the, at the time, I did not understand what that was, but I was truly transformed into the high priestess. I did not understand my intuition at the time. So I didn't understand what was going on, but I knew something wasn't right. So what did I do? I ran away from the connection. You know, and of course, things happen in the connection that cause you to hurt the other person, but really it's just a mirror of you and the things that you need to heal. Okay, so you have the runner chaser dynamic, it's natural, it has to happen in order for the other person to heal, opposite, whichever way, flipping how it should. But this person here, this person knew you guys were twins, they knew from the beginning, they knew before you did, <coughs> yeah. What's the twin flame here? What did I say? This person, the twin flames. This person, there was there's also was some uh, some some spell work between you two. This person tried to treat you like a mistress. This person tried to side piece you. They hid a lot of secrets from you. There was a lot of things that this person now wants you to see. This person played a lot of games when it came to your connection. If they left you and played games, the people that they were dealing with were very karmic. This person was surrounded by warfare and attack. Mm -hmm. But I tell you, high priestess, in reverse, if this person knew you guys were twins, they walked away from you as an actual high priestess. Their twin flame was a high priestess. But they, they went towards witches, people that were attacking their energy. Yes. This person brewed some serious karma. What is um, Fresh Start here? What did I say? Yep. Karma. Reconciliation in reverse, too. This person did not come back. They played a lot of games. They did not reconcile. They made the wrong judgment. They went down the wrong path. They chose everything opposite of their divine counterpart in the connection. This person, um, they could have moved. They could have left you and went and moved and bought a house with somebody or started a new life with somebody or um, stayed in the, went towards a toxic, chose a toxic connection over you. This person, um, they stayed in this connection. Whatever they went towards, they stayed in it and chose, kept choosing it over you. But they wanted to keep you someone who take high resonance. This person wanted to keep you as a side piece, okay? But then still treat you shady and mistreat you and lie to you and have some type of t motive behind it just to hold on to you and whatever they were they left you for. 
okay? So this person will come in and out of your life. They're under heavy judgment, karma, when it comes to judgment because of how they treated you. Yeah, what did I say? We're going we're gonna to reshuffle that that flew out with the other. Let's reconcile. Yep, this person wants to resurrect the connection. This person brought it to a death. What did I say? This person was the one who killed the connection. They want to reconcile. This person wants to pull a Lazarus on this connection. What is GPS here? This person did the most. And the thing that caused this is this person was... Um, they knew who you were. They knew. Both of you knew. See, if you did not know you guys were twins, you guys knew that this was a special connection. You knew. You and this person was making plans. You and this person has the eight cups at least invested in this connection. Some of you even have families. Uh-huh. What is the GPS? Yep, this person did not want you to be single. They're trying to find you. The nine of pentacles, you turned your back 100%. You guys can focus on yourself. Mm-hmm. You change directions on this person. They never expected for you to change directions on them. This person thought they had control. This is this masculine. I'm just why I'm feeling it's a masculine. This ma masculines are very possessive over their empresses. The emperor is very possessive over their empress. This masculine could have treated you like they were, like you were their property when you guys were together. This person was very overbearing. This person was very hovering. They they were very much um, clingy when they were with you. Because they were very domineering when it came to the connection of who you are. I don't mean in a negative way. I mean the way they loved you. They loved you hard when you guys were together. But when they left you, they were shady. They act like they didn't. Even, it was nothing like that. This person kept choosing other people over their twin. Yeah, they made you feel like you were not the one. They made sure that they chose over you because they felt like they could always come back. This person was was um this person was kind of delusional. They thought everybody was that there was nobody above them. This person thought they were very egotistical and arrogant. They thought they were like the the best thing since sliced bread. That that you were beneath them. That if even if you were beautiful and pretty and handsome or pretty, this person was like you ain't me. I'm better than you. I got control of the situation. This is my connection. You are gonna always need me. You gonna always want me. Cause everybody else made them feel that way. But it was an illusion. It wasn't real. So what's that up here? What did I say? The wheel has turned. You guys moved away from the connection here. Yep. It's the tables have turned on this person. Because I tell you, twin flames are a mirror. So what, what goes around comes around. This person mistreated you. So whatever they went towards, this person is now seeing that whatever they did to you, they're getting it back 20-fold. And this person was mean to you. They're the black side of the heart. This person treated you like they hated you. Yeah, when you were their divine partner, their twin flame. What did I say? This person tried to one-up you. They, were, they treated you like they hated you. I said that. And you were their twin flame. They mistreated you badly. What is moving on? Letting go. Yep, you guys let go. This part, what did I say? This person treated you bad. Narcissist. This person was very narcissistic towards you. They were very cold. They were very callous. They never showed you any love. They never made they, they were it was easy for them to cut you out and move on away from you. This person, um, when they chose if they if they chose somebody over, they made it very clear that they didn't want you. They made it very clear that this person was their choice. This person made did everything they could to hurt you. And they hid a secret. Whoever they were with, this person had no idea. But if that person, this person was one up. Your twin flame. Because if they chose a high priestess in reverse, this person was doing spell work and tarot to know to keep up. And they knew this person was, was your twin. They knew you guys were twin flames. It was a double-edged sword with the shadiness when it came to twin flame connection. Because they were being one up by whoever they chose over you. Whoever they chose over you was teaching them a heavy-ass lesson right now. Whatever they chose over you. It's not working out in their favor. Because if they chose a witch in reverse, this, this, this high priestess in reverse, or a practitioner, anything that was connected to dark work and dark tarot, this person was planning, they planned this person the whole time. They knew that they had a twin flame. They knew it. Yes, they did. What did I say? Running. Deception. This person was deceiving you. That's why they were running. And now they want to reconcile. You guys got tired of the darkness. You got tired of being unhappy. You got tired of being hurt. You got tired of playing games with this person. Yeah. What did I say? What's blocked? Yep, you guys blocked this person out. But it's but it's, see, look, it's it's the same thing here. It's block it's a block for a block. It's a mirror. And this person could have also worked against you. They could have blocked you out and worked against you. With this person that they chose over you or the community that they chose over you. To keep you single, 
Yeah, that's what was going on here. This person was still hating on your love life as well, too. Yeah, I told you guys you were being one up. This person attacked you. They worked against you, and you guys are you guys are clear on it now through spell through, through the um the, the other spell work being done through tele telepathy and your secrets and dreams. God is revealing everything to you guys. Yep, as you can handle it, as you heal, God opens up more for you. He lets you know more of what's going on. This person worked against you. They cut you out. Ace of Pentacles. They thought you were a bum. They treated you like you were a peasant, like you were beneath them when you were the blessing. You were the Ace of Pentacles. And they turned it upside down for something that was not even real. They also worked against you to steal your money. This person attacked you. If you, They started using you for sex. Some of them started using you for sex to get to get your finances. And they were taking back the energy to this person here. Yeah, that's why they're going through heavy judgment. Your person's going through heavy karma right now. Judgment in reverse. Yeah, they are. This person was lying and deceiving, telling other, telling other people they didn't love you. The King of Cups, this person was very much in love with you. They held back. Twelve Flames are very much in love. The love never goes anywhere. Nope. Even if you don't, if you're not together, you will always love your person. That's how it goes. Yep. And you guys decided to leave the situation out in the cold. Was this person abandoned you first? Some of them could have married somebody else, even though you guys, Twin Flames, are already married. So this person went towards something else and invested their time into something else and blocked you out. And now you guys are guarded and walked away. So this person, whatever happened, they don't they don't have a space to be mad because they're the one that caused all of this. That's why the Wheel of Fortune's here. This person caused this. You guys were willing to heal or whatever you guys had going on. You guys are both tested, okay? On this Twin Flame journey, I can tell you because I've been on it for 10 years. You guys are both tested. Before God pulls the veils off, he reveals everything. It just happens out of nowhere. One, when you, one minute you're good, you think everything is good, then, then your life just go to shit. It's because God tests you both on your love, your love space, your heart space, on how you're going to treat each other. I can only speak for myself because I've been through it, my, my part, so I can share that with you. Me, when I, I, was, I was a runner. Yes, we we gonna both run. That's that's the way it is. But I never mistreated my masculine. I never talked down about him. I never blocked him out. Like I would run from him as far as seeing him because we have very strong sexual chemistry. So I would run because I didn't want to end up sleeping with him. So I would run from him in that sense. But as far as text messages, phone calls, any support, anything happened, birthdays, anything like that, I was always I would text. Happy birthday. He lost somebody my condolences, those type of things. But I was never malicious or evil. That's the that's the yellow side. That's, I mean, that's the red side of the heart, the love part. Because there was always love there. But when it came down to our connection on, a, on the flip side, when he became the runner, he turned into Satan, okay? So that's the dark side. But that's because a lot of times they have, the, the, the people that they're running with are witches. They're running with witches who turn in them against the connection. That's what's going on here. I know the truth now because I'm the high priestess. But at, at the time when you're going through it, it's hurtful, it's painful. It's, it makes you feel lost and confused and not understand why this person is hurting you when you've done nothing but love them, okay? So I understand if you guys are there in that space, I get it. I've been there. That's why I'm here to help you guys get through it, okay? Four of Cups. This person, when I said this person kept rejecting you. They were, they were, and this person would come in and have sex with you. So that they can attach and steal from you. And just to get your abundance. This person was still in the robbery. They were one up in you the whole time. But you were trusting this person to be that per You guys thought that you were okay. A lot of times they would come in and make up like you guys were good. And then they'll attack you behind your back. So this person, well, you were sleeping with the enemy. Mm -hmm. Ten of Pentacles, why say they stole you? Let's try to steal your inheritance. Yeah, they, work, they worked against you to steal your inheritance while they're under judgment. Whoever they're working with... They're under judgment. Whatever they worked with against you is under judgment. It's karmic people, or karmic connection, or karmic coven, whatever they are, they're under judgment. They stole your Ace of Pentacles and your Ten of Pentacles. And they tried to give it to somebody else. Yep, the karmic, whoever they chose over you. A, a high priestess in reverse is a witch. Yes, that's what they did. This person is under judgment for not taming their loins. Mm hmm not thinking things through. They held back they held back from you because and because they had uh they wanted to be a player. The people were chasing after them, making them feel like they were extra important when it was nothing but karma. Yep. Whew, wow. They left you out in the cold. 
this person think they're gonna get the same energy back from you that they gave you, but that's not how it works. That's not if you're truly healed, you're not that's not how it works. Yeah, that's not how it works. I was not vengeful towards anybody. What did I say? Now this person wants to commit to you. This person left you out in the cold, now they want to come back and reconcile. Mm-hmm. Yes, they do. What did I say? The devil was involved heavy here. Yes, the devil was involved here. This person chose the wrong path. They chose the wrong direction, which was the devil. They chose the devil's path, the, the devil's direction, and it was not wish fulfillment. Yep, this person stole from you, and they went to commit to the wrong situation here with the King of Pentacles. You guys know this person is now broke. If they if they married, uh, if they were committed to another person, you know that person was now a karmic, and it was still done through spell work. It was uh, love spells and commit to me magic and sex magic that got them stuck. They stuck themselves to the devil. They left their twin flame for the devil. They rejected you for the devil and refused to turn directions. They attacked you for, with the devil. This person took everything from you. It was not wish fulfillment. They were never happy in this connection or this situation. The King of Pentacles in reverse was a wrong commitment because you guys are already married. So this is not a real, this is, this is a false contract. Not a cuff that left you out in the cold for their secrets. A lot of them were bisexual. Okay, Lord God is letting it out. This person was committed to their wounding. Give me one more energy here. Yep, what did I say? Absolute truth. This person left you out first. They, they left you and they blocked you. They act like they didn't even know you. This person cut you completely out of their life. And now you're guarded. And you're single and you're successful. Mm -hmm. This is justice for you and karma for them. That's what's going on here. Let's get this and see what's going on. We're going to go to the other side, y'all. Wow. Yeah, 12 flying connections. You can't do that to somebody. There's some shocking news coming through, okay? This person was living for the moment. Going living by the city of their pants. Mm -hmm. Living in the moment. They, were, they, were, they sacrificed everything just for the moment. Yeah, but that's all shattered right now. Give me some more, Father. Yep, police. We got the police somewhere involved. With something with money or something corrupt, somebody going to jail for stealing. Yeah, some people may be going to jail for stealing your inheritance. Whoever they went through, there was a corrupt connection. Because they got the King of Pentacles in reverse. Your person may be going to jail. We got the justice on the board, too with the police, which usually means somebody's going to jail. And it for, it's financial because the King of Pentacles is in reverse as well as the, um, the King of Pentacles is in reverse as, as well as the Ace of Pentacles. It's something financial. Yeah. This person could be spinning the block, drive by, stalking you, curious. You guys, are, this person used to use sweet talk to come towards you. It don't work anymore. Uh-uh. No, it don't. But I say romance. This person missing your loving. If you guys were sexual, this person misses making love to you. Yep, they are romanticizing about you. This person could be watching you from secret accounts. Yep, this Jezebel, whoever they dealt with is going is leaving. The situation's ending with this Jezebel. Uh huh. This person could be watching you from if they're blocked. They could be watching you from secret accounts, or just a coward sitting back and not. Um, coming towards you mm -hmm. side eye apology unsure motives if this person apologized to you you're going to look at them sideways because they did so much to hurt you and you guys don't believe that they're serious this person was um a reckless player they did not think that was a very reckless what i mean by that just they, they just flew by the seat of their pants they didn't make they didn't think about nobody's feelings they were very selfish they did not care this person did not as long as what they wanted in that moment worked out for them they didn't care what nobody else had going on this person didn't care they were heartless mm -hmm, they were and there's some more what's going on here get some more in here and see what's going on this person needs a spiritual cleanse too yeah uh negative energy empath eliminate problems detox rebalance this person that's some this person has some serious attachments attached to them uh-huh yep i'm not an option 
You're not going to play me. I am not, not a placeholder. I am a prize. You guys, this person was shocked that you guys walked away. Yep, they shot. They're, they're, they're really shocked. This person thought that you, you, you truly, you, you triggered the shit out of this person. The T, eavesdropping, getting all the information, telling secrets and lies. This person was living in the moment. You're about to find out what was going on behind the scenes and why they rejected you. Yep, we are about to find out. By curious, what did I say? Somebody was bisexual here. Bisexual tendencies, th things you don't know, keeping it confidential. See, this keep coming out. This person was a clout chaser. They would do anything for money. Yeah. And this person, whoever they chose, this, this karmic amplified their wounding. And this person's to telling the tea is on top of the karmic. This person telling all the tea. This person was living a wild life here. Oh, yeah, they were. Uh-huh. This person could have been dealing with a police officer, too, to keep themselves out of trouble with the things that they were doing. And the police officer was the same sex. Black magic, voodoo, spell work, witchcraft, rituals, divination. What did I say? Abuser. The person that they were with was playing them. It was a double-edged sword. Yep, it wasn't wish fulfillment. But your person now is double stalking you, spinning the block. This person is stalking you, and they've been they had a big ego. This person was all in their ego. And they, they are, and the, this person here, they stalking you because they 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 um missing you sexually. This person is craving you. Yeah, they can't they could not find another you and nobody else. You blew this person's socks off. And they, they cannot find this person had a lot of sex partners, male and female, both sex, and they could not find anybody better than you. Because you're a twin flame. There's no higher sex than that. It's not. Uh-uh. No, it's not. You're not gonna find nobody better than your twin. Yeah, what did I say? Uh, let's see here. Give me one more. Well, give me one more energy when it comes to the Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, what did I say? You guys refuse to be a rebound. Yeah, this person was used to having rebounds. Mm -hmm. Jump into a connection, fight, flight. Not over their ex, not, not emotionally healed. If you guys are refusing to be a, a, a option. It's said on both ends. That's why you guys walked away, you turn your back. Because you guys see a lot, you know a lot. And then when it comes down to it, this person, they never chose their twin. They never chose you. Yes, you are the, the option, the one. And this person tried to make you a rebound. How are you going to make your divine part of the person who you, the, the, the rib of the body, a rebound, a side piece? The person they left you for was the side piece. You're their divine partner. That's why they're in trouble. Yeah, because this person was afraid of love. Terrified of the same mistakes, don't want to meet the wrong person, fearing of, fear of opening up. This person was afraid of love. Yeah, they were. And, it's, and they, But they handled it the wrong way. This person handled it very maliciously, like you were an enemy. When you were, when you were nothing but a helpmate and a true lover. And that you would have never hurt this person, never did anything to them. You showed this person nothing but love when you guys were together. Yeah, the spell work amplified it, but this person still made their own decisions because they were selfish. We're going to take this over to the other side so we can get into this reading and clarify these messages um, over to Patreon. If you guys like to join us, uh, the link to both channels is in the description box below. Click either one, go over to the About tab, which is the last tab on either channel, and click on the Patreon button, okay? It will take you over to Patreon. You, got two, you have two tiers you can, assign, you can sign up for either one, okay? Uh, the, the first one is 144K. We'll be meeting on Tuesday um, for a video. Okay? That's once a week. Then we have the second tier, which is the one everybody gets. It is five videos a week. Okay? You get the 144K chat and four extended readings a week. Okay? If you guys would like to join us, welcome. Okay? I record. You guys can go back and, and watch the videos and catch up with the rest of us. Okay? Um, I am taking two questions for $15. If you guys need the ASAP, add $10 to that, and I will get it to you within 48 to 72 hours. The $10 extra is only for the two questions, okay? Um, 
we have two special readings on month on, on sale this month. You guys have to the last day of the month to sign up for them at the at this range, okay? Raw Truth is on sale, regular price $70. I'm giving it to you for $55 this month, okay? And we have the Twin Flame slash Soulmate reading, which is if you're a Twin Flame and you want to check in, great. If you want to find out if you're a Twin Flame or if you're a karmic or if there's other soulmates coming around you, this is the reading for you. It's on sale, regular price $77.77. It's on sale for $65 this month. Okay, $65. Um, you guys have to last that a month to book that at that price at 11.59 p.m., okay? Um, what else? I think that's it. If you guys need a payment plan, I have that as well. Email me, okay, if you have any questions. Uh, if you don't have it all up front. Uh, that's, it's been working for us for over two years. It's, it's the bomb. My babies love it. I'm grateful that you guys appreciate it. Um, what else? If you guys would like to send me a token or a gift, um, my PayPal and Cash App is the same. It's, it's, the, it's what you use to send a gift. If you do say DAG is a gift, if you, if you need to pay, pay, make a payment for your um, reading, my PayPal and Cash App is the same as well for that. Um, if you do pay for a reading, make sure that you guys say, Dag, this is a reading. And this, and email me back. Do not put it in PayPal. Do not put it in Cash App. After you make the payment, email me. Okay? I'm, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go looking for you. I got too many people to take care of. So if you do email me, say, Dag, this is my I paid, this is how I paid, and I'll get you set up, okay? And um, make sure you put the reading in, this, in the subject line as well so I know what you're, what you're paying for. <sighs> Make it easy. I, the Empress don't like stress. Okay, I can't do it. I won't do stress. Um, what else? That's it. I think if I miss something, please email me. If there's something that you need, you have a question about, if you don't see a reading down below that you want, email me, okay? Anything else, I thank you guys so much. Please make sure you like, share, and subscribe on the way out Both re into both channels. The other channels, in the, uh, both of them are in the, in, in the description box below, okay? Patreon, if you'd like to join us over there. Patreon, um, make sure you check us out, okay? And I'll see you guys on the other side. I love you, and I will be back with you on Tuesday night. Namaste.